Prim's algorithm to find the minimum spanning tree on a distance matrix. So a distance matrix is just a network which has been put into a table. So in this question we've been given a table and they're asking us to start at A. So we put a 1 above A. That means we're at A. So we can't obviously travel to A, so we cross out the row with A in. We now look for the smallest number in A's column. So that's 12. 12 is the smallest number. So our first, uh, our first part of traveling will be from A to C, which is 12. People always seem to forget to actually do this part of the question, writing down what they've got to do. So we're now at C. So we put a 2 above C. Obviously, if we're at C, we can't travel to C. So we cross it out. Now we're looking for the smallest number in both of these columns with numbers on. So you can see that the smallest number in both of those columns is 23. So this part of the matrix is AD. So AD is 23. So we're now at D, so we put a 3 above D. And obviously if we're at D, we can't travel to D, so we cross out the row. We look for the smallest number now in the three rows, number 1, 2, and 3. So the smallest number this time is obviously 15. That is D, B is 15. So if we're at B, we put a 4 above B. Obviously we can't travel to B, so we cross out the row and we look for the smallest number in the columns 1, 2, 3, or 4. You can see that this time it's 71. So we write down BE is 71. That's our fifth one. So we put a 5 above the E. If we're at E, we obviously can't travel to E, so we cross out the row. And as you can see, now the whole thing has been finished because all rows have crossed out. We then add up the numbers in this column, which will tell us what the minimum spanning tree distance is. So 12, add 23, add 15, add 71, uh, will give us 121. So the minimum spanning tree distance is 121. So that's a prims algorithm to find a minimum spanning tree on a distance matrix.